children let's enjoy another session of literature with me so this time i thought of selecting another poem which falls under the same category that means humor the poem is two's company by raymond wilson it is prescribed for your third term i mean grade 11 third term so uh, first of all i'll just uh, furnish you with some information about our writer, Dr. Raymond Wilson. Dr. Raymond Wilson, actually he is a well-known author. He has authored five books to his credit. Not only that, he is an esteemed professor, professor of history. And he has published dictionaries, encyclopedias, so you can just have a clear understanding about his erudition. Erudition means Right? And he's from Pennsylvania. He's from Pennsylvania. And uh, I think this much of information uh, is enough for your knowledge. If you want more, you can just surf the internet and find more information about Dr. Raymond Wilson. Right. Then let's go to the poem. As usual, prior to go to the explanation part, I would like to introduce you the title. What is the title? Two's Company. What do you understand by Two's Company? Oh, company means what? Mukatabi company kakkila kyaani. Samagamak, Himnetta, Asura, a friendship between two people, two's company. The Dinku Atratina, Mitra Queer, Netta, Asura, Tamamudra, two's company, Kila Handunwani. Now, if your books are ready, and please turn the page number 19 and see there's a subtitle also. Immediately after the, I mean right below the title, there is a subtitle, Upashirsha Theorema. Now read it, what does it tell? Mukhat Dekin Kyarne, the sad story of a man who didn't believe in ghost. It is very, very satirical. Harina Upahasya, itana Gabvila Theorema, humor also. Ekyarne, me, Kavi apit nokia kiyanama api kochchara munat me holman avatar pirbandava api khatin kiyubata vishwasa karanne ne kiyala api vishwasa karanwa it is a perennial or oh, everlasting fear rooted in man's mind me minisaadi hadavate gapvela thina sadathika bayak vidhata me holman avatar walata thiyana baya hanunwannata puluwa right now let's go to the explanation part of the poem and see line by line what the poet tries to tell us about this protagonist of the poem. Protagonist, the central focus or the central character of this poem. May poem is a central character. Protagonist, uh, Dr. Raymond Wilson is trying to tell his reader. Right. How is the poem, how is the poem started? They said the house is haunted. Om Kirma me gaya arak gatta gya. So what do you understand by this? Mukhati making therine arak gandva kela kyaarne there's an evil spirit in that house. A Gither in the way, Gruhi in the wa Art Mayakatan Avatariak in the wa, right? Holmanak in the wa. Kao the Tokabi De Kilakiani, De Kilakiani must be the protagonist's neighbors or must be the protagonist's friends. We can take it like that, right? 
next word then ඒගොල්ලෝ කියන මේක ඉතර ආරක් දෙන තියෙන්නේ කියලා so but නමුත් but නමුත් but he laughed at them so this shows the protagonist uh, reaction towards what his friends or neighbors say then we are going to make it react කරන්නේ react කරන්නේ නැත්තම් ප්‍රතිචාර දක්වන්නේ හිනා වෙලා laugh කියන්නේ හයියෙන් හිනා වෙලා තමයි මේකට ප්‍රතිචාර දක්වන්නේ and said tat tat right and said tat 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 means he disapproves it his disapproval is brought out there ඔහු ඒක පිළිගන්නේ නැහැ කියන එක අනුමත කරන්නේ නැහැ කියන එක මේ මොකක් පිළිබඳ වද concept of ghosts මේ හොල්ම අවතාර විශ්වාස කරන්නේ නැහැ කියන එකට තමා එයාර tat tat කියන ඩොක්ටර් රේවන් විල්සන් uses that tat tat බෙහෙල් කරනවා I never heard such tittle tattle. मैं अपने माँ का बता बात हुआ है ना मुन्ना आदर. Tittle tattle. Tittle tattle means meaningless talks. So the protagonist is trying to tell us that he is not believing in ghosts and believing in ghosts is a meaningless thing. Right? Okay. As ghosts that groan and chains that rattle. In the next line, he tells us what he has heard uh, of ghosts. I mean, people say different. I mean, things about ghosts. So they say ghosts are groaning. Groaning means they cry painfully. Bhuma veeda na var kheg hilda ke gula ta hena ke la ke la. And chains that rattle. Uh, rattling means clinking sound of metals. Uh, when they walk, when ghosts are walking, a sound can be heard. Uh, people say, "Mini sukhenwa sadya kehenwa," as if metal clinking. Or lower the cup, it cut a gap. Inama magay sadya kehenwa kela kehenwa. Right? Now go to the next play. And just to prove I'm in the right, please leave me here to spend the night. He challenges. उपकर Please leave me here to spend the night. Okay? Maav me kider dalay ani mama me raatre gath karla pen nanna. Ai gath karani to prove that there's no such I mean thing called ghosts. Hol man kila de apne hi kila pen na dai me aade. Utsaha karani. Ah we can call him first as a challenge taking character, not challenge averting character. Ar abiyog. हमुए पलायन नेतन अधारित के निकट में या चैलेंज टेक अब योग बार गाने के निकट राइट गो टू द अदर लाइन्स आल्सो दे लिफ्ट हिम जस्ट एस डस्क वास फॉलिंग अ वंस अगेन हु दिस दे दिस दे आ द नेबर्स और द फ्रेंड्स ऑफ द प्रोटेगनिस्ट This protagonist either can be boy or a bit grown up man also. I think it's funnier if we think that him as a grown up man. Ne, the lamey put a wedding me. Tika wedding na manu se ke na pi thana gat thana meke or comedy situation ne kar wedding la apita then na. Right. Then one day neighbors la mukut karan ne. They left him just as dust was falling. Him na tam friends la mukut karan ne. सिंहलिंग gomman velav so what is the relevance or the significance of this time to the poem 
लोह के अंदर ना हाँडा इतनी यार ऐसे नाये बाती हाँ ऐसे चेंज रहते समवन स्क्रीन काउंट जो यार तुझे नहीं क्या कर पा राइट दिस साउंड दिस ट्रिक वंस अगेन इंटेंसिफाई हिस फ़ियर यार के पाये नहीं वैरी कर गो टू द नेक्स्ट टाइम कम कम इट्स मेरी नर्व्स नाउ ही इस ट्राइंग टू विड्रो दैट आइडिया now that idea has already, I mean, crept into his mind. Yeah, the other thing that make that that but ring again, but I mean, then whole manak kill not yet. Now what he is trying his best to dispel or withdraw that idea. Eka ehi mane me eka ayin karla danda hak karla danda balan dia utsa gan bide kam kam it smelly nerves. He is certain. Yeah, no, that was sure. Me me eka ehi me kap ni me kira. But look at the line given in this. Parentheses. Now, me varahang yata di tina line ka diha balanda. Just the same, he draws the curtain. Now, me eh ekka man ya curtains a jane di tira atinwa. Ekyan he does not want to. I mean, see the outside. Eliya balanda oni na bayani. Ah, so he but still he does not admit it. Tham ek pili ka na pili noge na. Now, but his action proves that he has. Become afraid of any possible uh, ghostly existence in this house. Then may I make them better hina ti anwa ti anek. Na tan may I ta ibaya deni na ti anek apita pain ma from the way he behaves. Oh, hisle na akar di ha pal ko ham apita ekha o bud kar ganda pulwa. Right. Next one. Another line. It's very interesting. It says. The stroke of twelve, but there is no clock. Don't have a dinner man. Ah, is there a rose girl? Me, Thamathi or rose dear na ma. It announces the time by striking. The time. Me can a time me ka vadi na ma. A kai na, a kha. Dola kai na, dola ha daan daan gar vadi na ma. So that is also that fear intensifying sound. Me ka red dola ha kya lekhe ne ka. Because normally people know that's that's. Another time, which these evil forces become potent. So, with that understanding, right, his fear becomes more intensified. Thavat me agi baya vedi vedava. The stroke of twelve. Ika tevedi thavai ka ke na, but there is no clock. That that means it is ghostly act. Ika ar abathana me kriya. Okay. So when he hears that, what does he do? Now look at his actions and behavior. Right? He shuts the door. He quickly goes and uh, shuts the door and turns the lock. Not only that, he turns the lock also. Lock her lagana. Why? Because he is conscious about his safety. Then yah de agi araksha pilibandva yah kalpana agama. But once again, within parentheses, the poet says like this. Of course, he knows that none is there. They are done. Ma kaurud ne kela. But no harm's done by taking care. E unadi din pare samuna kela mona mabe na wada. So it is also very ironic. He is very clear. We know he is now frightened. Then why the lie ne? But at the same time, the fright gives an excuse for him. या बिन में ट्राई तो देना एक्सक्यूज़ है कार, हाँ, बोल कर मैं यार मैं पीली गाने में दी किनेक्ट नहीं मेरे कर, ना मुझे दें या ही हैज़ ऑलरेडी आई मीन एडमिटेड, हाँ, एडमिटेड इन अ सेंस ही डस नॉट आई मीन वर्बली एडमिटेड बट थ्रू हिस एक्शंस वी कैन अंडरस्टैंड ही हैज़ एडमिटेड दैट, राइ हाँ इलिए इन नाम हम मोड़ भी रुका रहे हाँ ही इस ट्राइंग टू कंसोल हिमसेल्फ यहाँ हम कंसोल कर गाने आउटसा कर गाना वंस अगेन विद इन पैरेंटसेस इट इस सेड ही मे एस वेल पिक अप द पॉक पॉक इस एन आयन रॉक मे आकर पूरा कुछ आत्र गाना बिकॉज़ इट्स ही इस व्हाट इस कॉल वी कॉल दिस डिफेंस मिकेंसन थमुंब आरक्षा कर गाने थमुंब नोदेन में क्रिया करना कार्य ही टेक्स एन आई आई ड्रॉप दैट नॉइज अगेन आप इतने में आकर साथ दिया है ना वांस अगेन ही चेक्स द डोर्स शटर्स द विंडोज 
right? I kill a balala and make a pose. That means he is thinking uh, what is to be done next. He don't have to make a pose. He don't And he puts uh, that into action. He doesn't have to make a pose. He doesn't have to seek the safest place to hide. Then he doesn't have to make a pose. He The cupboard is strong. He creeps inside. Hari kabar dekat tienwa, gila ring dekwa. Now you can visualize that this uh, protagonist uh, cuts a very poor figure here, very helpless. From hero to zero now. Then ada vira ada, vira kena gili hilah di hilah. Not that there is anything to fear. Now he is uh, consoled. Ah, then nam bayi bende dia ni, abg kabar dekhe ni. Wapas hari the permit is also very less. Uh, you can see around and nobody is there. Uh, he is consoled. That time, uh, not that there is anything to fear, he tells himself, when that is here, voice breathes softly. It's good to me out of the head, voice is like a hand up, he means, he means, Muslim guy, my yard, he can't allow it. How do you do? I'm a ghost. Pray, who are you? Uh, because how do you do? Yeah, it's a very, you know, polite, uh, I mean, greeting. When you first meet somebody, we say, how, we, we say, how do you do? Then me ghost however it is the very very friendly but uh, how do you do? I am a ghost, what call me? Pray, who are you? I am a coward. So Raymond Wilson ends this poem with much humor because we have, uh, I mean, uh, what is called some sort of I mean, creepy feeling or what is called uh, fear within us. But what does he say? We should not be afraid of ghosts. Right? He does not paint a very, I mean, horrible picture, uh, I mean, a frightening picture about ghosts. But he introduced ghosts as a very friendly uh, uh, existence. Right? So I think uh, you might have understood uh, what the poem uh, tells us. Right? Now we are going to discuss the literary devices or the poetic techniques used by Wilson Raymond to compose this poem effectively. You know why these literary devices are used by the poets? You are very, you know, uh, in, I mean, to create an effect. Okay, so what is the first one? The first one is subtitle. Uh, but now when we uh, look at the poem, uh, at the beginning of the poem, we come across an introductory line or a subtitle. So, why a poet uses a subtitle or an introductory line? And me kabi me vage subtitle leka, e me introductory line leka paavichi karani to reinforce the idea he is going to discuss in the poem. Oh, me kabi yathu le kata karani ana. Adahas, terkis yang anu banyak, itu halak bin sangkata ma, ini dia ter introductory line kan paham cikaran. And next, we see the writer has used the technique called satire. The satire kian teknik kian kan paham cikar lagi yang ma, that is to attack the weaknesses of people. मिनिस्ट्री में सामान्य वीकनेस इस तरह को टापी दाना समाज के टे ये बाकी बाहर वादी ना बट दिस एटैक इस नॉट आउट ऑफ आई मीन सिनिकल मोटिव्स बट टू करेक्ट दे मे भी तेरे बाहर देने बहुत भी टे मे सिनिकल नहीं तां मे खाटिये टे मे मे गुलाब टे किसी आम खराद रहा खराद नहीं ना मुझ ए वैरेंट हा� now, next one is humor, right? We often, uh, we are made to laugh. We are made to laugh as we are going through this line, lines, especially the way this uh, particular person behaves. Uh, when we look at the way he behaves, uh, it, they make us laugh. So, humor is there, right? Next, contrast. What do you understand by contrast? Contrast, what can you say? फरस पर विरोधी बाबा का दाख पुनवा एक है ना ये देखिए अतर दें उदाहरण या पश्चिम नाउ एट द बिगिनिंग द वे ही बिहेव लाइक अ हीरो बट हाउ ही एंड्स अप एस अ फेलियर नाम अवसान है दियो हो असार्थकार 
ඉස්සල්ල තිබුණු එකට වැඩි හාත්පස විරෝධී ප්‍රතිරූපයක් තමා ගොඩනැගෙන්නේ ඔහු පිළිබඳව මේ කවිය අවසන් වෙන දිනකට සුද්‍යාස contrast there that hero becomes a coward hmm ara veeraya antimeta ma nivata ek bawata pat wenawa and visually nature uh, we get a lot of i mean uh, visually sensitive images or pe- pictures in our mind right goda me drushya samvedi roopa nirmane wenawa the way he draws the curtains the way he locks the door checks them back and uh, what else how he poses and tries to find a safe place to hide all these things come as i mean mental pictures apita manorupa vashayen api laba ganama right next one onomatopoeia or echo sounds right that uh, i mean uh, chains rattling sound uh, he says chains rattle so that sound is heard by us that sound is heard by us uh, we call them echo sounds or onomatopoeia understand right next one priming couplets now if you go through the poem once again uh, towards the end of these lines uh, you see uh, two i mean pairs of priming words or uh, pairs the pair is priming a a pair ka rhyme venawa උදාහරණයක් වශයෙන් but tat hmm uh, tattle rattle like that uh, go through the poem and try to uh, i mean pick them out okay right next one parenthetical citations now he has used this technique i mean a lot but at me technique ka vichar karala thiyenawa how many parenthetical citations are given are parenthetical citation kiyana ara warahan athule sadahanak karanawa e warahan athule sadahanak karanne just to bring out the contrast once again are viru viru viruddha bawa e kiyana kiyana de neme to show that there is no consistency between his word and deed ohuge vachane saha kriyawa tula කන්සිස්ටන්සි එකක් කියන්නේ අනුකූලතාවයක් ගැලපීමක් නැහැ කියලා පෙන්වන්න තමයි ගොඩක් මේ පැරන්තටිකල් සයිටේෂන්ස් මේ කවිය විසින් යොදාගෙන තියෙන්නේ රයිට් නෙක්ස්ට් වන් මිලියඩ් ඔෆ් පන්ක්චුවේෂන් මාක්ස් මල්ටිටියුඩ් ඔෆ් පන්ක්චුවේෂන් මාක්ස් දේ දේ හැවින් යූස්ඩ් ඉන් නොට් ගොඩක් පාවිච්චි කරලා තියෙනවා විරාම ලක්ෂණ uh when you compare with any other poem in the anthology you will find that this here the poet has used a lot of punctuation marks why to bring out that confusion that uncertainty right so that is also a technique ekat me kavya upakramaya vidyata apita bhavitha karanna puluwan sadhan karanna puluwan and there are um, I mean times uh, where when this I mean uh, there are places where uh, the protagonist has used direct speech. In that samhara thank you know, Riju Khatne Bhavita Karna me protagonist we see and irony. Hmm? So the first line is an irony. Anu padya akne the. Itna mati you know, anu padya. So irony is used. And what do you think of the? Uh, poetic diction or the language used by the writer me writer ki bhasha pirivada monawada kiyanna puluwa it's very simple spoken language me api katha karana normal language ka thama me sandha yuda gara thiye because to show the lightness of the theme but actually it is a serious theme uh, we have to admit that but he has used uh, i mean simple language to talk about this and rhythm is also fast because uh, to you know in still fear within us because when we get afraid uh, when we are afraid of something uh, you know uh, even our heart beat right uh, becomes very you know fast ekat vegawat wenawa and e wage metena me fast rhythm ekak yoda gannawa kaviya visin i think you understood the literary devices uh, we discussed Uh, next we are shifting to themes right api ilata yanne 
moving towards themes. Api me mona madhe me thuling apni tar ganda puru am pani mida. Or what Raymond Wilson is going to, I mean, convey through his composition. Me composition ne kahar ham mona madhe karne karan ne kahar ne kya ne kar apni din saara kara bala. Mu phala bini theme ka bide tar I would like to discuss man's everlasting. And deep-rooted fear for supernatural elements, right? Now, though we are very, I mean, highly educated, or we are ignorant, this uh, fear towards ghosts is within our hearts, in our hearts, and it is a deep-rooted fear. Eka harima gyanurata mul besagat na. We are always trying to pretend that we are not afraid of anything, and we are trying to, I mean. Uh, challenge these ghostly existence and the concept of ghostly existence but this fear cannot be removed so easily from the heart of our people appi minissunge hadavatwali meka ayin karanna beha meka neda raymond wilson kiyan utsa karanne how he accepted the challenge and how he ended up abiyoge baragan kohoma dan thiyata avasana ne kiyen ka apita pennenawa विश्वास वाव लुक है रहा ना कोटे that fear aggravates because we know they are the possible arrival of a of a ghost we will say of a ghost right and there are people in our society also who act and behave like this ये तो कोटे देख अपने समाज के दिन वा मिली सु मेरे में प्रार्थनास्त्र के हैस ना दे या sometimes over confident ඕනෙම වැඩිය තමුන්ට පුළුවන් දෙයකත් වැඩිය තමු පිළිබඳව තක්සේරුවක ඉන්නවා ආ ස්පෙෂලි අබවුට් අන්නෝන් මැටර්ස් දැන් නැති ඒවා පිළිබඳව මේගොල්ලෝ කතා කරනවා ආ ඒකත් මෙතනින් අපිට තීම එකක් විදිහට ගන්න පුළුවන් and the next one is තවත් එකක් තමා people they use defense mechanism when their safety is threatened actually it happens unconsciously ega means me kene hithama tham karna deyak neme lawai if we are you know uh, threatened or if there is a possible danger right we automatically right use this defense mechanism to protect us api api var araksha kar ganne men defense mechanism that's why he is taking an iron rod If there is a possible danger, he is armed. Ne to who? Sanat vilai nama. Ah, that is also taught here. And uh, the other thing is, uh, uh, Dr. Raymond Wilson is trying to tell us that ghosts are not a thing to be afraid of, because this fear is baseless. Me fear ekha pe thulati ana me baya ki ana kaarane. एकर फादर मार्क नहीं किए ने कहने में दुखी ना ने, हाँ, because we uh, we have a preconceived idea about ghosts. अब इधर खाली मापे इधर ने ना ghosts के अने हरी में बयान कर दे आप केला. But if we I mean uh, dispel this notion and if we begin to think of ghosts as friendly force, yes, they will become very friendly. So that's what he is trying to tell us. I think uh, you have been able to understand what we have discussed today. Uh, so thank you very much once again for being with me, and hope to meet you uh, through another lesson. Till then, goodbye.